decided not to go on the long walkabout today because uh, right now the distances have grown so much that it needs some preparation and choices and my brain doesn't like choices in the morning but I am capturing a little small coffee walk instead little selection of our summer sky and summer noises now this clearing on my right is the same area uh, that I wandered through in one of the videos see those are the young pines way back over there this one Seems to be a newer-ish logging operation. Some of those woods are the ones uh, where we used to go for uh, shrooming. I mean, somebody has put a traffic sign there, but I guess that doesn't apply to uh, pedestrians. But I'm too lazy and unprepared uh, for full-on foraging. So I'm just going to continue on on this road a little bit and see if I can at some point cut through the forest over there and uh, and rejoin with my uh, usual gravel path the smaller gravel path uh, from this side mm, some interesting dead trees over there in the midst of the uh, seedling pines Wait a moment, is there a nest up there? Huh. Okay, looks like I have found a possible dirt road going in, but it looks like it hasn't been used too much. And this uh, this particular uh, forest patch was quite uh, wild, so I don't want to go in there right now. I will I will keep on going a little bit. Besides, I still have uh, plenty of coffee left. I think I can actually smell blueberries. I didn't uh, come prepared today uh, for proper picking, but I might do that some other day because they should be just about the right ripeness. Oh, I think, I think this is a little bit of a broadish, puffish thing. So yeah, I'm gonna cut to the right from here, see where it leads to. Hmm. Bloopers are indeed abundant. Also, they are not as overly ripe as I was afraid they would be. So there's still plenty of time to go picking. Unless somebody else gets there first, of course. Oh, and the thing with blueberries is that you can scrape off the light blue patina. I, I guess that's why in my native language we call them uh, blackies instead and I, I don't think I can find the uh, find a sample of the other uh, berry that we call the blueies that remains uh, blue even if you scrape off the patina so this path is going strong in the right direction well, it looks like logging road so I would expect it to end up properly um, on the other path and not to s just sort of dwindle away hmm I'll just keep on on this one so clearing ahead and I'm pretty sure that the next uh, forest wall that I see over there is already on the other side of the uh, gravel path pretty sure what do we have here? Hmm. 
this is a tasty fresh bread. And there are more here and here. Whoa, whoa, this whole clearing is full of raspberries. I might have to pick a little bit after all. There are so many. The best part is I think somebody has already come here to pick them, but they just keep on coming. <laughs> keep on growing. <laughs> I have now come uh, far, farther into the raspberry field. So here's a little uh, health and safety PSA. Uh, this is not exactly the area where you would want to come barefoot unless you really 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 know what you're doing. So what I'm doing is I'm mostly standing on one spot doing my thing uh, before I move on. I try to clear uh, the grass uh, up until the uh, up until the ground, so that I can actually see what's there. And it also helps a little bit, supposedly, if you stomp your feet every now and then, because if there are any snakes resting in the area, then they sort of get the idea that oh, big stompy animal coming, time to get farther away. So yeah. And now I might be di causing distress to that bird over there. Well then, I would say I have quite sufficient amount now. I might add that I ate about uh, twice as much on site and then I just sort of got tired. I mean, there's no way one person uh, can pick them all. And, I mean, not that you would have to, but there is this certain competitive, gotta catch them all thing kicking in. Anyway, I'm gonna catch my breath, drink a little coffee, and then start walking first onwards, and then backwards. Hmm, it appears that the, this uh, logging track is not uh, leading to the road at all, which means I might have to cross this uh, this part on my own. So let's see. Again, health and safety PSA applies. Although here the visibility is greater. Ah, there's, there are some older tracks as well. I'll see how... I, I will see where's the best way, uh, best place to break through. Now I said I wasn't going to pick any bluebirds, but fuck it. I can't eat that much, I'm going to take some with me. Forest takeaway. I think I know why the bluebirds I tasted weren't all that ripe. Because now that I take a closer look at the stems, it seems that somebody has already picked their share from here. And this is the uh, second wave of the berries that are getting ripe now. Which makes perfect sense. Hello! Some early foxberries are getting somewhat ripe as well. See? Mm, doesn't, doesn't taste so good yet. It has a very distinctive, like, spicy, bittery taste. One that I'm very fond of. But yeah, these are gonna have to grow some more. I'll be back. Okay, now I really have to return because uh, this kind of bag is not a very good uh, vessel uh, for berries, especially the uh, raspberries, because they're going to be squished. So if I add any more, um, I'll pour some jam. I'll return some other, ta other day with the uh, takeaway boxes or something. Okay, these babies here are all ripe. It looks like nobody has picked any here as well. I'm not gonna pick any, but I am gonna stay and eat some. <laughs> Onwards! Now that I have stuffed my face with all those blueberries, 
I'm continuing on to find a good path out there and I think I'm going to I'll make my way to the uh, uh, to the forested edge over there because I think it will be easier to cross uh, this uh, belt uh, over there than it is to just sort of wade through the uh, young forest and the uh, questionable ground. Look at it. This is your basically your battery porn right here. Path is right here and it looks like somebody else has come through here as well. Gonna use that and put the camera away so that I can see what's really going on on the ground. And we're out. I am actually a lot uh, farther this way, meaning downstream by the river, uh, than than I originally expected. I mean, I guess if the if I had uh, followed the course of that uh, logging path, I would have exited somewhere over there. But I kept steering this way. So yeah, I still have plenty to walk, and I even have some coffee left. So onwards. Ooh, I better speed up. This looks like rain. <laughs> 